When a healthy person experiences trauma like a bruise, the immune system kicks into gear. Immune system cells flock to the site of the injury. They consume damaged tissue and repair it. But when people like Holly experience the same injury to their muscles, tendons, or other tissue, these cells cannibalize the body. They ravage both damaged and healthy tissue in the trauma region. In the wasteland of dead tissue, a few living cells remain. They are stem cells, cells able to transform themselves into different types of tissue. While in an ordinary human, they would form into scar tissue or replacement tissue, in FOP patients, they morph into cartilage and then bone. And eventually, ribbons and sheets and plates of bone replace the body's skeletal muscles, cross the joints, lock them in place, and render movement completely impossible.